Terrarion! I forgot to mention one very good attribute of this weapon, which I will demonstrate in a short click of a moment. To do that, to demonstrate it, that is, I will need to summon another Eater of Worlds. For that, we'll have to go back to some place that I've been before. And I should probably organize my inventory. Probably gonna use those as well against him. I don't know why I'd actually want to fight him again. I don't have much of a purpose. He doesn't drop anything that I want. Well, I could use the money. I still need to buy the mini shark. So there's a reason. Mini shark, ahoy. I'll see you when it gets to the corruption, because this is probably going to be just another boring walk over to the, the there. Yeah. Be at at seeing ya. What's up, Doc? No, screw this. I'm going to show you how I walk around the landscape shooting at things randomly with my space gun. Ah! I don't know if it actually... It adds... Now it's 17. It was 17 and now it's... That makes sense. It adds about 50% damage and it shoots you for free. So that's 19 damage. Very fast, but not much knockback. But it penetrates an infinite amount of enemies, I think. Which means it is very good against the Eater of Worlds. Too bad the bullet's really small, so you can't hit things very often if they move when they're tiny. So I'll see you there anyway because I don't feel like doing this all. It runs a little smoother and I like it more because it's a journey and you need to enjoy the journey in order to enjoy the destination. But that only counts for you guys. And actually, it only counts for me. You can go fuck yourself. Now that was just mean. I didn't mean it like that. I'll probably go in the jungle next. The jungle's an exciting place to be. See you later! This is where I fought that guy last time. If I locked a little bit further, I would have found another life crystal. Which is another 20 HP. <sighs> Fan-fucking-tastic. Oh, now I insulted the fans again! I need to stop doing that, because you are great guys. No matter what you believe in. Because honestly, here that doesn't really matter. Here, it's about you and me being guys. Manly man, unless you're a woman, in which case you are a manly woman or whatever you prefer to be. You can also be a girly man, or a manly woman. Be whatever the hell you want to be. I don't discriminate. I do discriminate if you're an idiot, but that's completely different, because if you're an idiot... Oh, you're working already. Wow. Didn't expect to go that fast. Oh yeah, I already got the Orb of Light one, yeah. Okay, let's see how fast this is. See, see, look at that, look at that. It goes straight through him. Like a pew pew pistol. It's, quite, it's not as much as the, the Vile Thorn, because the Vile Thorn sticks around a little and everything. You know what, I'll check a grenade at him. Bombs away! Two accessories of the same kind. You can't wear the same accessory twice, which is, I mean, I guess makes sense. You could do that before, and it kind of broke the game, in my opinion. We only need ten more gold, yay! But I'm gonna buy some new shit. So I'll see you at the jungle, because I'll be doing the dungeon later. First loot, wooden boomerang. 
superior wooden boomerang. Forgot to put my mic down. Arrgh! Stop doing that! It's such an annoyance because it greatly reduces the quality of my sound, I think. The entire last episode, I think, was made using that. The awesome part about this is that it's a very good light source as well. Despite it being green. If you think these bats are annoying, it could get much worse. Take this as a loot. Take it as the loot it is, boy. Actually, the loot I'm after is a very particular kind of object. It's known as jungle spore and consists out of uh, green stuff. I'm gonna kind of lose a live stream once. But I don't think I'm the live stream kind of character. Because it puts so much stress. Oh god. Oh, it's just a snatcher. Ooh, menacing flippers. That could have ended much worse. But yeah, menacing flippers. Uh, allow me to swim. I could put my clock away because day and night doesn't matter much down here. And the extra damage is all. Look at that! 20 damage! Cal Sabrina. Oh, god damn it. They also shoot poisonous stingers, which are a pain. Oh, that's the man eater. And that's a life crystal I could desperately use. I'll use it in a desperate manner. But yeah, that's a man eater. Stronger version of the snatcher deals some of the highest damage of any non hard mode enemy in the game. I need the vines to make the tri vine grappling hook, which has a bigger radius and is all around awesome. So guess why I'm down here. But for that, I will also need jungle spores. For jungle spores, you can also make a particular set of armor that is also heavily oriented towards magic. Which is kind of cool, because then you have you have the darkness melee armor. You have the... Sh the I'm not even going to spoil that one. You have the darkness melee armor. You have the metal melee armor. And they've got this awesome magic set that either comes from the stars itself or comes out of the jungle. Which I have to say, is some pretty good interesting in design choices. Nice flair to it. Cal Spring. Oh, god damn you, NCS. You and your fantastic voice editing software. Unless that is your real voice, in which case, kudos to you! I love this gun. My biggest concern about using strong ranged or magic weapons is just the using of magic and all that stuff. That, 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 that glowing little thing, that's a, that's just jungle spore. I could grow my own jungle. Save myself the ish effort. Oh yeah, one thing you'll find in jungles a lot are gems. That is for, be that is not because gems are, I don't know if gems are more common. But the main reason is you see gems a lot easier. They're not a pain in the butt to find. Yay, rubies, those are pretty expensive. I can make a lot of money off of that. I found my first diamond in a jungle. And then I died. I did. Not, not, not kid. Look at that, diamonds. Not as useful as in Minecraft, they're only used to make the sabers. Which I can actually already make. No, I don't need that. Anything I can ditch that, that I'll ditch that, and ditch that. Wow, we can do that. Didn't know that. He just had to bring it up, didn't he? Ah, I need vines! Oh, oh, god, no. Oh, I don't want to be poisoned. I don't want to be poisoned. Poison is bad. Poison is bad. Ah, but shooting you is good! And it feels good. Dun -dun 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 -dun. 
I feel nice. Do 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 do. Like sugar and spice. I don't even get that comparison, to be honest. I need to start throwing something away, or this is going to hurt. More jungle spores. More jungle spores. Should always light the way because then you know where you've been. Who the hell shot me? Boom, baby. I don't even use that, so I might as well toss it away. Ah! I don't think I need many stingers. You can use it for a thorn shrakram, which is a pretty good weapon. It's an upgraded version of the boomerang, so to speak. The actual upgraded version of the boomerang is much cooler than the thorn shrakram. But the shrakrams are not bad. Or the thorn shrakram itself, it is one thing. There are a lot of spores in there. I want to get there. Originally, you used, uh, I think, jungle roses. And now you can still find jungle roses, but they're a vanity item. And I have to say, I like it. Or they're just a vanity item now. Oh, they still give a little light. That that that's good design right there. That's quality detail design. Oh dear God. I have to say I'm doing better than I usually do. Usually during my first few explorations of this place, I tend to die because of the lack of experience. Because it takes a little getting into the dungeon. This this functions completely different than the dungeon, which is a place and a biome. It's a biome on its own actually, because of how monsters spawn and everything. And this is really bad. What the fuck are you doing here, man? Don't talk about P. Diddy. I'm gonna read a cracked article, I think. I need some calming down right now. Not because something bad happened. Or because I just did it. Oh, screw you, Hornet. Honestly, they spawn a little too much sometimes. But that's just because I'm not paying attention. There, I'm gonna read a cracked article because I am way... I should do that because I like reading them daily. That's my pastime. Which is about 4... between 4 and 3 o'clock here in the afternoon. And I use a 24-hour system. Screw you people who still believe that AM and PM is an effective system to denote time. You know, AM and PM, I, I am not... I'm not as angry about that as I am about uh, the metric versus Farron versus the imperial system, and apparently it's a blood moon. So I'm gonna go now for now. See you later. Blah blah blah. And then they died. Oh, forgot my mic. So yeah, we're still down here. Yay! Great fun. So yeah, we're still in the old dungeon. Hey, look, life crystal. It's always fun. The hell did that just go? Did I use it? Or did I throw it away? That golden thing over there is the jackpot. In case you don't know what it is, that's a jungle temple. It's at least what I call it. Essentially, inside that is some of the best loot you'll find in the entire jungle. Getting to one... Finding one is a little bit difficult because they're not exactly common. But luckily, when you find one, it'll probably be worth it. Take care that I don't hit that guy. Oh, bring it! gonna pump you full of photons look at that look at that look at that damage way high oh shit ah how about a bomb oh god no 
and fucking tastic. Better. Still no vines, which kind of sucks. Feral claws increases melee speed. Very nice, actually. Um, yeah, I need to get rid of something by now. This is sucky. This is sucky. I think I'll leave the rest here. I mean, it's mostly about special loot. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not gonna take the rest with me. I'm mostly here for spores, anyway. Get it? Spores. You don't get it, do you? Ooh, trident, which is a interesting spear. Not all potion. That'll make my life a lot easier down here. Specifically because it makes that, that orb thing a lot more efficient. Well, the reason I don't have any vines is because I can't pick them up. I think I should do something... And I think I'm going to do it anyway. Regardless of what your opinion is. I'm going to make and use that stupid piggy bank for once. So I can get rid of some stuff. Pick it up back home. Specifically, I'm going to throw away stuff that I won't commonly find. So in order to put it down, we're going to need one of these. Seriously, how much water was in there? Quick stack. Which else should I put in there? No, I'm gonna find lots of that. This I won't find a lot of. This I won't find a lot of. Mm, copper watch, don't need that right now. Diamonds? I should put those in there anyway. Because of how my mechanics work. Um, no, oh god, actually, I always store stuff. Um, yeah, microphone is okay. Um, oh, those are Jester's arrows. Those are a lot better. Yeah, I think I'm okay for now. Pick up those extra spores over there. How many spores do I actually need in total? I don't even know. Quick stack. Um, put those spores and those stingers and those can go away. Trident is... A goblin army. Right now! Oh! I have to go. I have to go home immediately. Because this can go real nasty. Real fast. I have shit that I need to sell you. Listen closely, Demetrius. You might not make it. But I've always trusted in you. Take good care of the kids, okay? What kids? Yeah, I know there are no kids in here, but that doesn't mean you don't have to bother me about it. Jeez. This is the Goblin Army. It's a random boss battle that can happen whenever you broke, break a Shadow Sphere and have enough health. They're not that annoying if you got the means to take them out, but this is really annoying you won't get out of the way. They drop particularly spiky balls, the harpoon, and they allow you, I believe after you kill them, you're allowed to find in the dungeons below, what was it again? That one guy, uh, the Goblin Tinkerer, who also sells the rocket boots, which I really, really want, because the rocket boots are fucking awesome. The rocket boots, how are they not awesome? They can break down your doors. Sucks. Pro tip, never stop shooting. Ah! Why does water move slower? I know that, that, that other materials cause water to move slower because of light speed and braking indexes, but in he says, I don't know how you say it in English, I think indexes. But still. Oh yeah, the sorcerer shoot energy orbs that go through walls, so don't even think about hiding. You can also find scouts from time to time, 
They drop a special piece of cloth you can use to make a standard, a battle standard or something that you can use. Oh, look at that. You can actually point at them and a chaos ball. That's what they are. You can actually destroy the attack, so you don't have to worry too much about it. I don't know what more kind of loot other than the harpoon they drop. I already got the harpoon, which is a sort of mace-like weapon, but it functions slightly different. I think it still functions like the old mace used to, in that you can't swing them around, they just shoot and they're done. But it's pretty powerful. 25. No, not my gunman! You believed in you, Demetrius. But it seems fate had other plans, and now Mortimer's dead. I think he was my shopkeeper? The most, the biggest loot is just the gold you get. Look at that. Penetrative power, go. And that was not a double entendre. Oh, shit. Uh, no, not Tania. Wow, they, they are really killing everyone. Ah! Judge! Why isn't this battery running out? He has space armor. Magic space armor from space. Which is somehow spacelier than any other sort of armor. Ah! Never surrender! It takes a certain amount of kills before they stop appearing. The ones that are already spawned at that point will keep just stay, but you, they're not that hard when they stop spawning. It's the spawning bit that of uh, the, the massive amount that just kills you. Ah! The Goblin Army has been defeated. A Goblin Army has been defeated. And Heather died, so I got a full refresh of names. Which I guess is kind of neat in its own way. There you go, normal music. Spiky balls, which are pretty much like the other things, the harp. No. Oh. This is how the old maces used to work. Which is actually really fast and dangerous. So it's quite, quite powerful. Um, problems... Yeah, I need to wait for everyone to respawn before I can... S These, um, they work just like, uh, uh, throwing stars and everything, and those kunai. But uh, once they f stay, they stay down, and they can be used as traps in sort of way, so... It's whatever you want to do with it. Oh, yeah, I forgot I can swim. Look at that. <laughs> I'm gonna see how long the video is. I think I'm gonna call it a quit soon, because that's been quite the adventure. I'm gonna store away some things, pull out some items that need to be stored elsewhere. Should I take this? I mean, it is good. Nah, I'm not that good with the damage stuff. I'll keep that in there because it looks nice. Looks nice. A flower statue. You know what game I also like is Dungeon Defenders. I don't like it in the sense that I want to play it a lot. Throwing knives. They look like kunai to me. No, actually, kunai are different. They're just circles with diamonds on top, sort of. They're not kunai. What the hell am I saying? Yeah, I might do dungeon defenders if you want. If you want me to. If you guys, fan people, think that's worth shot, then I'll go do some of uh, that. I'll probably take a bed over there and make spawn point there next time, so I can explore the jungle a little more, or I can go after the boss. It's completely what you want. You got three choices. Um, and if nobody picks, then I'll, I don't know, you can prick three things. I can go to the jungle, which is my choice. Um, next to going to the jungle, we can also go to the dungeon to fight Skeletron or whatever his name is. And finally, we can do some Dungeon Defenders, which will be posted on the random footage, because I only keep my main series and everything on it. And Dungeon Defenders is not very much of a story game. Well, I'll see you guys later regardless. Bye-bye!